All right, it's a perfect time to eat your way through January. I mean, we're homebound, so right. why not enjoy? Why not go out and get out of the house and enjoy something? Several great locally owned restaurants being featured. Yeah, one place you got to check out, JT Walker's in Muhammad. We have owner Justin Taylor and Terry Resek for Visit Champaign County here in the CI Kitchen. So, Terry, earlier you were here this week. We were talking about Eat Your Way Through January. Yes. JT Walker's, why did you choose them as one of your local favorites? Because they are one of the biggest hidden gems of our community. Um, it's a little bit outside of everybody's comfort zone. It's not in the Champaign-Urbana area. It's just a couple miles away in Muhammad. So we really want to push people out to that area to discover their incredible restaurant. Um, as he's going to show, they're not just about the food. They're also about the beer. And it's just an incredible atmosphere. So we want to make sure people are going that way. Right. So the Eat Your Way Through January lasts through January? Yeah, 30 restaurants, 30 days. Awesome. Yeah, so talk a, Justin, talk a little bit about the great atmosphere that Terry mentioned. <laughs> Yeah, uh, JC Walks, we got a few uh, different elements that, that people can enjoy. We have our main dining room, the restaurant, a little more cozy, a fireplace down there is nice to warm up to uh, in the winter here as it's cool. Um, and then upstairs is our sports bar area, uh, a pool table, a shuffleboard table, a lot of TVs, so you get more of that sports bar atmosphere. Your bar area is great. Oh, thanks so much. And yeah. then across the street, uh, a lot of people don't realize is... Um, our brewery that's been open for just over a year. Um, you can go in there and check out a bunch of our different brewers. We have beer, uh, tenders on tap. Uh, brought one today. Our Walker's Original Cream Stout is our winter seasonal that we just uh, just kegged this week. Wow. And it's named after my son Walker, who's one. So this is Aww. our second uh, version of it. So. Cool. Cool. So you also are known for your beef. What you do, what you do with burgers and steaks and all that good stuff. So what are you cooking? Yeah, right, right now uh, cooking a ribeye. We're gonna make uh, something that is one of my favorites. A lot of people don't know about it. They don't try it. It's called the blue cheese steak wrap. Uh, so it's uh, ribeye, actually mashed potatoes, blue cheese crumbles, and mushrooms. And you put it all in a wrap, a tomato basil wrap. Oh um, my. So it's uh, one of those that a lot of people don't know about and haven't tried, but it's one of my all-time favorites. So I thought we'd make that today, which also really good in the winter, and it goes great with a cream stout. So Yeah, a nice comfort food Absolutely. in the cold. So what's your favorite thing on the menu? And or what do you get the most compliments on? I, I want I do want to hear your favorite thing, but what do you uh, hear the most feedback on? It, we sell a lot of burgers and a lot of wraps. People really like our chicken wraps. We have a variety of a uh, few different types of chicken wraps. Uh, 10 different burgers, so a lot of people like those. And then uh, something a lot of people like on our dinner menu is our pastas. And then we also have steak, salmon. A lot of people really like our salmon. Uh, it's an herb crusted salmon. We sell a ton of that. Um, and then our pastas sell really well. We have a variety of different pastas. Yeah, so. we were looking at a picture there of your rooftop with the lights. Such a nice, I'm sure, venue for people to come and hang out and have a nice spring, summer meal. Yeah, people that haven't been there in a while don't realize uh, we opened a rooftop patio uh, a couple years back. So um, it's upstairs right off of our sports bar. So it's open uh, in the spring and then all the way through the fall. Um, it's a nice area to kind of, uh, you can kind of look over downtown Muhammad because um, it's pretty high up there and uh, we have outdoor TVs and heaters and, and all kinds of good stuff. Now, I don't want you to give away all your secrets, but <laughs> what, when I'm cooking, what's the one thing I can do to make my to make my beef really sing, whether it's a uh, steak or a burger? The good thing is all, is all is season. A lot of people forget to season the yeah. meat. So taking salt and pepper, um, making sure those, those things really bring out the fats in the meat and really okay. make that meat way better. I mean, you're just going to get a totally different taste when you add salt and pepper to meat before you cook than if you just put it on the grill and cook it straight. Um, something we add a little bit too is a little bit of Cajun seasoning too. Some spices sure. just get a little bit of a, a blackening on there. It just gives it a little more kick. So that's something that uh, we put in a lot of meats that, that people like. It's just a little bit different. Yeah. Okay. So you're encouraging people to branch out of Champagne, head out of town Absolutely. to Muhammad. Anywhere else in Muhammad? Maybe we could swing by on our way? Oh, there's so many great options out there. I, if you go down through the downtown area and just right off Interstate Center, where you're going to find a lot of great options in Muhammad. So do you guys do you have these listed online where people can check these out? We're actually posting on Instagram using okay. the hashtag Eat Your Way Through January, so you can see all the places that we've been. But we want to know where you're going, and you can win a fifty dollar gift card if you share with us. Nice. Okay, what if you go somewhere and it's not necessarily a local restaurant, but okay. you know another favorite in town? Hey, as long as you're out visiting our businesses, that's all that counts. Hey, keeping yeah, right. right. the money local exactly. and supporting great owners like Justin here, exactly. who's got a family, yeah. he's doing great things and making good meat. Yeah. yeah. And we're going to let you continue cooking because we can't wait to see how this wrap turns out. Mm -hmm. We're checking out Justin's website right now for JT Walkers. So if you need any more information, you can go there or head to saleliving.tv where we'll have that all shared after today's show. It smells so good. It sure <laughs> does. Very yum. Mm. All right. It's